I'm positive it was Susan Hayward. No, no, it was Rita Hayworth and Glenn Ford. Excuse me. Wait here. I'd like you to meet my associate, Bear, movie stuntman, champion weightlifter, as you might have noticed. Throws things out I don't want. I think you ought to turn around and go back to Miami. You're a stuntman, huh? Yeah. You're any good? Am I any good? <laughs> <laughs> oh! Oh! That's something bad for a guy his size. I'll make you a deal. If you can get out of here before I take my coat off, I won't clean up the floor with you and mess up your pretty little costume. You don't know me. You only think you do. That guy is a stuntman. Yeah, he was in Creatures, too. This movie business. I may have to go back to Lone Shark and just to take a rest. <laughs> Harry, what are you still doing with those guys? He happens to be loaning me five hundred thousand dollars. No strings. I can write any kind of agreement I want. Cash or check? Cash. It happens to be sitting at the airport in a locker at this moment. A locker at the airport, Harry. Jesus Christ! Tell me you're not really that stupid. You're being set up, Harry. He pulled him out of that freak stand. Now he's paying you back. Is that right? Mm -hmm. He's setting me up. But why is it that Catlett said I should send you to the airport to pick it up? Since you haven't done a fucking thing for me since you got involved in this, except show Bo Catlett my script. You're right, Harry. You're not the one being set up. At least Bo is invested in three of my movies. Harry, we spoke with Martin. We? Mm-hmm. Chili and me. Really? Yeah, he asked us to call Buddy, set up a meeting. A, a meeting? Mm -hmm. You and Karen? Harry. <laughs> Guy's been in town two days, and already he thinks he's David O'Fucking Selznick. <laughs> 